What's up guys, it's Mike from Jersey Connect and today we're going to be taking a look at the LA Clippers City Edition jersey. And you know how to get my favorite robot, Kawhi Leonard. This year's jersey design is actually inspired by the LA artist, Mr. Cartoon. And he's a well-known artist known for his illustrations, his street work, and then he's also a tattoo artist. And in 2019-2020 they did a City Edition jersey with a white colorway. But this year they just kind of reversed it and made it black. So a little lack of creativity there, but they're lucky I like this jersey. <laughs> so in today's video, what I'm gonna do is unbox the jersey, take a closer look at the finer details, and hopefully help you decide if you wanna purchase this or pass on it. If you guys find this video helpful, an easy way to support the channel is just by hitting like, subscribe, and I have a notification bell so when I drop new videos, you don't miss out. Let's go ahead and get this started. So right over here, I got this at Nike.com for 110 bucks. And we got the first look. Boom! So you got this Los Angeles across the chest with that classic like script and font. And ooh, dropped it. And we got Kawhi Leonard. Let's go ahead and take a closer look at it. And when we go to the top of the collar, you have a white base. And when we go to the left side of the arm opening, you have the blue colorway, kind of like a blue trim that's sublimated onto the collar. And on the right side, it's going to be red. And when we go to the NBA logo, since it's a Swingman jersey, it is nicely heat pressed. Then we got Kawhi Leonard. So the white lettering pops out on this black jersey and they are all heat pressed. And we go to the numbering, you got number two. It's just pretty much a plain white colorway. And then you can kind of see the side panels. It's just a white base, and that's the back of the jersey. When we flip it to the front, the collar is white. And when we go on the arm openings, you got one side with the red trim, and the opposite side with the blue trim. And when we go to the neck label, this one's a size large, made in Guatemala, dry fit. Let's knock out these retail tags, NBA Authentic, standard fit, dry fit, 110 bucks. And we go to the Nike swoosh. It's a white swoosh, nicely heat pressed. And when we go down to the lettering, so Los Angeles. If you've ever been to LA, you can kind of see street art that has the same type of like script or font. So it really brings out like the LA vibes. You got Los Angeles, all heat pressed. Kind of reminds me like I used to play GTA. <laughs> <laughs> that's like that's like the first thing I think of when I see this then I go down to the numbering you got the white base all heat pressed then we go down to the jock tag so you got your standardized jock tag swingman 48 and then right over here LA Clippers that is on the jersey right above the jock tag and then on the side panels, it's pretty plain. You just got pretty much white on both sides. And right there is the front of the jersey. And this is what it looks like when you wear it. So I'm 5'6", 175 pounds. We got the front side of the jersey. We got the side panel right over here. So they're both gonna be plain and white. And then we got the back of the jersey. And that's pretty much the jersey. Like I said in the beginning of the video, the previous year they had the white colorway. They just kind of flipped it and reversed it. So there is a lack of creativity there, but they are so lucky that I like the sleek looking jerseys, the dark and black jerseys. Probably one of my favorites because you can kind of mix and match it with a whole bunch of different outfits and shoes. At the time of recording, there's still a lot of these in stock on like major retailer websites. I thought I'd still be able to get it authentic because these things really didn't sell out. But I held on too long and it is what it is. I had to go settle with the swing man. What do you guys think about the jersey? Let me know in the comments below. And thank you again for watching and on to the next video.